Hello everyone, this is Kartar Sagar. I welcome you all on my YouTube channel. In this uh, video, I am going to discuss how to draw a title block. So let's see. First of all, see that uh, in title block there are few details which are mentioned. Like this is the layout. Now this is we are using BIS title block which is Bureau of Indian Standard which is used by students and uh, few details are there like date sign then institute name uh designer name seat name okay so you have to remember those details before drawing that bis standard title block now let's start okay now normally we are drawing a title block in the right corner of the right bottom corner of the seat so i am taking 18.5 centimeter which means 185 mm centimeter distance and locating a point second point that this is a height of 65 mm which means 6.5 mm so i am looking at the second point so we have to build a rectangle or we can say a block of 18.5 and 65 mm so 185 cross 65 that is the dimension of our title block so i have located a point of 65 vertically in both direction and horizontally i have located 185 so we we got the rectangle of 185 cross 65 so this is the rectangle see here you can see that uh, you can see this uh, block at the right bottom corner of the seat okay so we are using the uh, border lines of a uh, drawing sheet for creating the title block so this is the most important part Okay, we cannot draw in the middle or uh, top corner or anywhere in the uh, drawing sheet. We have to uh, locate it at the right bottom corner of the sheet. Now, uh, first uh, column, that is first block, which is having a dimension of 60 mm. So, I have located a point at 60 mm at top and bottom and making a block of 60 mm. Again, second block is of 60 mm. So, I have already locating up located a point and i am taking a second block and last block is 65 already so we have got 60 60 and 65 now last uh, last column may you can see that we have to take a point of at 25 20 and 10 10 this is the blocking we have to remember from top we have to measure 25 first then second block is 20 and last two blocks are of 10 10 mm height so i have already taken a point i am drawing a horizontal lines so that will create your uh, blocking of last column which is very much important so this is the blocking is over now going into the middle point only one block is needed one horizontal line at 30 mm distance so i am locating a point at 30 mm which means three centimeter from top and drawing a horizontal line so we will create a horizontal line at 30 mm distance from top so this is the blocking is over in second column and in first column we have distance uh, now remember first 10 mm at top and then two blocks of 10 mm, 10 10 mm from bottom so i have located three points uh, 10 mm from first so that is one centimeter at horizontal line at one centimeter and then uh, one centimeter from bottom two lines like that so we will get the blockings now this line is 10 mm from top and now uh, this line is 10 mm from bottom and the last second line is 10 mm from the last line so that is 20 mm from bottom line so this is our blocking now in between these two lines there needs to be uh, several blocks so that distance is 7 mm fixed so we have to take point at 7 mm then next 7 mm that is 14 mm then next 7 mm that is 20 mm 21 and then 28 so you will get four points okay you have to take uh, points at uh, regular distance of 7 mm and then uh, consecutively you have to take last point as a reference and take 7 mm so we will get points at 7 14 21 and 28 from the last reference line and join the points so we will get the 
line at 7 mm at the successive uh, successive lines so this is the main blocking okay blocking is important because you have to remember how the blocks uh, uh, will uh, located and that will uh, second point important point is that you have to mention the informations now first block is of 60 mm so we have to draw vertical lines at 20 20 mm so i have taken 20 mm and 40 mm as a distance and i am drawing a vertical lines so you have to draw a line vertical lines so you will get the main blocking so main important thing in this drawing is to uh, draw a blocking so in bis you have to remember this blocking first column second column third column. now you are, we are going to use lettering method okay in lettering method we are going to use scale or a stencil to uh, fill the details or information for example i am going to use scale so i am marking uh, light lines in between the blocks so i can use that as a reference for writing so this is a uh, light line which is not a main line so we are using only for reference now first information over here uh, you can see the main title block at the beginning of the video which have uh, information of date over here so you have to write date with the use of scale okay so i am using lettering method and uh, we have distance of uh, 10 mm in flush block if you remember that distance is 10 mm so we have to write in between so we i am using 6 mm distance for writing so height of the letter is 6 mm and i am writing in a uh, distance of 6 mm okay so i am uh, leaving 2 mm and uh, at the top and bottom of the block okay you have to remember that you have to do not you have to use border lines you have to write in between so you have to uh, make sure that your uh, writing is in between same uh, in second block uh, we will write sign so i am using scale to write a sign okay uh, for better accuracy you have to practice is practice practice the lettering more so you can write it fast as well as with accurate uh, dimensions so first uh, that is date is over and second is sign so i am writing it with the use of set square okay now the uh, all the information which uh, you can use uh, starting point of the drawing as a reference and uh, writing all the information will be uh, time consuming so i am skipping that part i am only writing how to uh, i am showing uh, how to write uh, or use lettering to indicate information so i am just writing date and signs and uh, other information you can see the reference video to complete all the dimensions okay so you can uh, write all the information by using reference lines and complete the title block okay so blocking is important and then information which is you can see the reference video and you you can write all the informations okay so uh, in this first column of first block you will write a uh, few information like dgn drn thd chd okay whatever the information is there you can see the reference video okay like complete uh, for complete we are using com and for uh, checked we we are using chd the short forms are used for completing the information so uh, whoever the uh, seeing this drawing sheet he can identify that uh, few information like who is the designer uh, we uh, drawing is from which company so name of the firm then in which year the drawing has been uh, completed or drawn like few information will be there in a title block so every title block uh, is having few information related to drawings okay few are administrative uh, details and few drawings are uh, information is technical information so likewise we will write with the use of scale now you can see this is the few information that you have have been written over here like name institute name 
okay so this is the drawing now this is the practice for practice so i have written the practice sheet normally the name of the sheet is written over here okay so this is how we will going to draw the bis standard title block